This weekend, a farm in Shano County is marking 150 years by serving brunch to their community. Here's a look at the host family for this June Dairy Month event. It was in um, 1869 that it was homesteaded by Wilhelm and Frederica Gors. Um, they came over from what was known as the Prussia area and um, they settled in this area and we have the actual deed that was signed from Ulysses S. Grant. The farm has grown a bit since then. We currently milk around 200 cows and farm about 550 acres. Missy is an ag teacher at Shano High School. And then anytime in the summer that they need help, I'm more than welcome to come out here and I enjoy that as a nice break. Um, and now that we're doing hay harvesting, that's my favorite thing to do is to help out with that. The farm has no outside help. It's my older brother um, and his wife and family and my younger brother, myself and the two kids and also my parents. Everybody has their own roles. Um, Dad is responsible for doing all of the field work um, and now we're getting ready to do hay. And mom does a lot with the calf feeding um, and of course getting all of us fed. And my brother, older brother Jeff does all of the feeding. My younger brother Matt does all of the milking and the grandkids just all kind of pitch in and help wherever needed to help out grandma and grandpa. I love working with the cows. It's my passion here. Uh, the genetics I've been involved with since I was in elementary school and it's just kind of the strong point here. Every generation seems to get better and we're really proud of the herd that we built. The family is excited to show off their cow comfort measures when the community comes for a tour. When we built our barn we made sure we put sand bedding in which is the gold standard for cows and they love it and they pay us back with uh, quality milk. Proud to share their past and plans for the future. It's been in our family for 150 years, so that runs deep um, in all of our roots. We're very proud of that and just to share our story and we're looking forward to passing it on to the sixth generation in the Gores family name. You can visit the farm yourself this weekend for Shano County's Brunch on the Farm. Breakfast is served Sunday from 8.30 until noon. You can find the full details on the Midwest Farm Weekly page on wearegreenbay.com.